Are you tired of dating the same old humans? Well, say hello to your new potential partner, a female humanoid robot. Yes, you read that right. The future is here and it's looking quite robotic. With the advancements in technology, having a robot as a significant other might not be far-fetched anymore. So, let's dive deeper into this futuristic concept and explore what it means for our love lives. Researchers at the University of Cambridge recently developed a female humanoid robot named Erica that uses artificial intelligence to generate its own responses to questions. The robot has been used in research on human-robot interaction and has been described as one of the most advanced robots of its kind. As technology advances, so too do the capabilities of female humanoid robots. These robots are becoming increasingly sophisticated, with advances in materials science, robotics, and artificial intelligence. Some models can even simulate emotions and express empathy through facial expressions and body language. A team of researchers in Japan developed a female humanoid robot named Shihira Eiko that was used as a greeter at a department store. The robot is capable of speaking in multiple languages and has realistic facial expressions, including blinking and smiling. This increasing sophistication is making many people wonder if these robots could one day be our partners. After all, they could understand us better than any human could and provide us with emotional support and physical assistance. There are already some couples who have decided to live together with a humanoid robot partner, and it seems likely that more will do so in the future. In 2020, a team of researchers from the United States and China developed a female humanoid robot named Jia Jia that can respond to voice commands, recognize faces, and make eye contact. The robot was designed to look like a young woman and has been used in research on human-robot interaction. Of course, there are also those who worry about the implications of living with a robot partner. They worry that we will become too reliant on them and that our relationships with real people will suffer as a result. Only time will tell what the future holds for female humanoid robots, but it seems clear that they are going to play an increasingly important role in our lives. As the world becomes increasingly automated, the entertainment and hospitality industries are looking to humanoid robots to fill various roles. Companies such as Hanson Robotics and Abyss Creations are at the forefront of this trend, developing lifelike robots that can be used for movies, television shows, and theme parks. The hospitality industry is also exploring the use of humanoid robots as greeters and hosts in hotels and restaurants. The use of humanoid robots in the entertainment industry has a number of benefits. First, they can be used for dangerous or difficult scenes that would be unsafe for human actors. Second, they can be used to create realistic CG effects that would otherwise be expensive or time-consuming to produce. Finally, they can provide a unique form of entertainment that is unlike anything else currently available. The use of humanoid robots in the hospitality industry is also gaining traction. These robots can provide a warm and welcoming presence to guests, freeing up human employees for other tasks. Additionally, they can help with things like providing directions or recommendations on local attractions. As technology continues to develop, it is likely that we will see even more widespread use of humanoid robots in both the entertainment and hospitality industries. A study published in the journal Computers in Human Behavior found that elderly people who interacted with a female humanoid robot named Pepper reported feeling less lonely and more socially connected than those who did not. The study suggests that robots could be used to provide companionship and emotional support to people who may have limited access to human caregivers. There is growing evidence that social robots can have a positive impact on the well-being of elderly people. A study published in the journal Robotics found that interacting with a female humanoid robot led to reductions in loneliness and social isolation among participants. However, some experts are concerned that too much reliance on robots for companionship could actually exacerbate social isolation in the long term. It is important to ensure that elderly people have opportunities to interact with other humans on a regular basis as well as with social robots. Robots have been increasingly used in a variety of settings such as office receptionists and airport customer service. The deployment of these robots is controversial because there is a fear that they may eventually replace human workers in these positions. However, the use of robots in these settings can offer many benefits over human workers. One benefit of using robots as office receptionists is that they can be programmed to recognize faces and answer questions in multiple languages. This would be beneficial for companies who receive international clients or customers. Additionally, robots do not get tired and can work long hours without breaks. 
This means that they can provide a higher level of service than human workers who may need to take breaks or leave early. Another benefit of using robots in customer service roles is that they can collect data about customer interactions. This data can be used to improve the quality of customer service. Additionally, robots can be programmed to upsell products and services to customers. For example, a robot receptionist could suggest additional services to a customer who is booking a hotel room. A team of researchers in Singapore developed a female humanoid robot named Nadine that has a realistic human-like appearance and can recognize people it has met before. The robot has been used in research on human-robot interaction and has been described as a step towards creating robots that can coexist with humans in daily life. There are some drawbacks to using robots in customer service roles, however. One concern is that humans may feel uneasy interacting with robots. Additionally, there is a risk that robots could malfunction and cause harm to customers or employees. Another issue is that robots could be hacked and used to collect sensitive information about customers or businesses. Overall, there are both benefits and drawbacks to using female humanoid robots in office and airport customer service roles. In the healthcare industry, female humanoid robots have been used to help with patient rehabilitation, such as assisting stroke patients with arm exercises. They have also been used to provide emotional support to people with mental health issues, such as those experiencing anxiety or depression. The use of female humanoid robots in healthcare is a growing trend, as they are able to provide a unique level of care and support that humans are not always able to provide. In many cases, these robots are able to fill in the gaps where human interaction is lacking, and they have been shown to be beneficial for both patients and healthcare professionals alike. Since the early 2000s, advances in natural language processing, NLP, and machine learning have enabled female humanoid robots to carry on more natural and responsive conversations with humans. Some models can even detect and respond to human emotions, using algorithms to adjust their responses accordingly. This has led many experts to believe that female humanoid robots could soon become our future partners in life, both in terms of relationships and work. After all, these machines are designed to please and serve us, so it makes sense that we would want them by our side as we go about our lives. There are already a number of companies working on developing female humanoid robots for both personal and professional use, and it is only a matter of time before they perfect the technology and release a product that is mass marketable. So if you're single and looking for love, or just curious about what the future holds, keep your eye out for these robotic ladies, they might just be your perfect match. As robots become increasingly lifelike, there are concerns about the implications for privacy. Female humanoid robots can be equipped with a variety of sensors, such as cameras, microphones, and tactile sensors, which allow them to perceive their environment and interact with humans in a more lifelike way. However, this also means that they are constantly recording and analyzing human behavior. There are concerns that this could be used to invade people's privacy, for example by monitoring their behavior in their home or workplace. There are also worries that the data collected by robots could be used to manipulate or control people. Privacy concerns need to be considered when developing humanoid robots, and measures should be put in place to protect people's privacy rights. The development of sex dolls and robots has raised ethical questions about consent and objectification. Some advocates argue that these robots could be used to reduce the demand for human trafficking and exploitation, while others argue that they reinforce harmful gender stereotypes and could lead to further exploitation of vulnerable populations. In 2020, a team of researchers from the University of California, San Diego, developed a female humanoid robot named EVA that is designed to assist astronauts on the International Space Station. The robot can perform tasks such as monitoring equipment and conducting experiments, reducing the need for human astronauts to perform dangerous or time-consuming tasks. The potential of female humanoid robots to transform industries such as childcare and elderly care is still largely theoretical, as the technology is still in the early stages of development. However, some experts believe that these robots could help address the growing demand for caregivers in an aging population. There is a growing demand for caregivers in an aging population, and female humanoid robots could potentially help address this demand. The technology is still in the early stages of development, so the potential for these robots to transform industries such as childcare and elderly care is still largely theoretical. However, some experts believe that these robots could be beneficial in assisting with caregiving tasks. As the population ages, 
caregivers will need to assist with tasks such as bathing, dressing, and feeding. Robot caregivers could potentially help ease this burden by providing assistance with basic tasks. These robots would not replace human caregivers completely, but they could supplement existing caregiving staff and free up time for other activities. The use of robot caregivers is still in the early stages of development, so there are many questions yet to be answered. For example, it is unclear how well these robots would interact with patients or how they would deal with emotional needs. There is also concern about the cost of these devices and whether they would truly be able to provide quality care. Nonetheless, the potential of female humanoid robots to transform industries such as healthcare warrants further exploration. As with all forms of artificial intelligence, there are concerns about the potential impact of female humanoid robots on society. One worry is that they could displace human workers, as they are often cheaper and more efficient. There is also concern that they could reinforce gender stereotypes, as they are often designed to be attractive and submissive. Finally, there is a worry that the use of humanoid robots could erode human empathy and social skills, as people would increasingly interact with machines instead of other people. It will be important to carefully consider these issues as technology continues to evolve.